Hello, my name is Chloe. I'm a threat analyst at WordFence, and today I'd like to walk you through what the exploitation of the cross-site scripting vulnerability we found in the all-in-one SEO pack plugin would look like. Now, before I begin, I'd just like to go over a couple of things. Uh, first, let's take a look at the users area. I just want to show you that we only have two users here currently, and that's going to be the contributor user and the administrator user. And then I wanted to show you that we are running a ver vulnerable, vulnerable version of this plugin currently, uh, 3.6.1, and uh, the latest version is 3.6.2, which contains a patch for this vulnerability. And just go to the post area real quick to show you that we only have one post currently here, and uh, nothing's happening on this page. There's no uh, malicious JavaScript injected or anything like that. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and log out, and we're going to log in as our contributor user. And we're going to head over to the post area. And we're going to create a new post as a contributor. And we're just going to go ahead and set the title to test and go down here. And this is where we're going to put our malicious JavaScript. We'll go ahead and paste it. And so what I have is a, a script that's going to alert uh, with the text, this is XSS, and another script that's going to inject a malicious uh, hacker administrative user in the background. And I have the same thing down here for the description, but for this one, I'm going to go ahead and add um, a closing script tag. And I'm going to publish, submit for review. And I want to go ahead and show you by clicking preview, we get that this is XSS prompt. And if we go back to that post page, we get it twice here as well because we have both the SEO title and SEO description prompts prompt, prompting up here. Um, What's not happening currently is an administrative user being injected because we don't have the appropriate privileges logged in as contributor, but now we're gonna go ahead and log in as an administrator and I'll show you that how that's happening in the background. So now that we're logged in as our admin, I'd like to go ahead and show you the users area just to show you that there's only those two users still. Um, but now I'm gonna go over to the post area as an administrator. I'm going to get that XSS prompt again, twice again, but this time in the background that um, script to create a new administrative user was also sent as I have the appropriate privileges. And once we go over to the users area, we can see that new administrative user account was created. And so that's just one way to exploit this cross-site scripting vulnerability. Um, I highly recommend updating to the latest version as soon as possible to help keep you protected against any exploit attempts against this.